the 2020 census is coming. It's important to be counted, and you may have questions. The census collects information for the government. The government uses that information to make decisions. These decisions affect people with disabilities. This video will answer these two questions. What is the census? How do I fill out the census? What is the census? The government counts how many people there are in the country. The census happens every 10 years. The census asks one person in every home to answer a few questions. A home can be a house or apartment. The census asks two kinds of questions. It asks questions about your home. Then it asks questions about each person who lives in your home. The census asks these questions about your home. How many people live in your home? Do you own your home or rent it? What is your phone number? The census also asks questions about you. What is your name? What is your sex? The census gives two options. You can choose male or female. What is your age? Are you Hispanic, Latino, or of Spanish origin? What is your race? For this question, you fill out boxes. The census lists different races. Some examples of options are white, black, or American Indian. You can check more than one box. After you check boxes, the census asks for more details, like what area, country, or tribe your family's from. The census will also ask the same questions about the people who live with you. The law says that the answers you give on the census must be kept private. The answers you give are not shared. The law does not allow for your answers to be shared for any other reason. The census does not ask if you are a citizen of the United States. Is it really the census? Sometimes people will mail you spam that says it is from the census. Here's how to tell if mail that says it is from the census is real or fake. The census will not ask for your social security number. If a letter asks for your social security number, it is not the census. The census will not ask for money or your bank account information. If a letter asks for money or your bank account information, it is not the census. How do I fill out the census? The government sends you a letter in the mail. They will send the letter before April 1st. This letter has instructions on how to fill out the census online. You can also fill out the census on the phone. You can fill out the census on paper too. Only one person in your home can fill out the census. If you live with other people, you should talk to them about who will fill it out. If you have questions about how to fill out the census, go to the website 2020census.gov. You can also call the Census Bureau at 800-923-8282. Now you know what the census is and how to fill out the census. To learn more, visit thearc.org census and make sure that you're counted.